Jason. In this video, I will be showing you how to design a wedding card in Canva. Once you have created your Canva account, I want you to tap on the search bar. And from here, you are going to type in wedding card. So let's do that real quick. After typing in wedding card, I want you to select wedding card. And you will be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you will see numerous templates that you can pick from. So all you'll need to do is scroll down until you see a template of your liking and from there you can select it. Keep in mind that any one of the templates that you see with the crown that says Pro, that means that you would have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular template. But there are numerous templates that you can use for completely free as you can see right here. All you need to do is select the template of your liking and from there you can start editing. So let's say for example we wanted to use this one. All you would need to do is simply tap on customize this template. Once you have tapped on customize this template you will be redirected to a new page. And on this new page you will also see different templates from the left hand menu option that you could choose from if you want. So all you'll need to do now, you'll select the image right here, go over to the left hand menu option, tap on uploads. After selecting uploads, you'll tap on upload files and from there you could upload the image that you would like to add. Or let's say for example, I'm going to be selecting elements and I'm going to be using one of the copyright free images right here. So I'll select elements, type in couples and then from here I could drag and place an image. Let's say for example this one. Then from there you could edit the name by tapping on the names. You can also edit the date by tapping on the date. And you could also tap on the address box right here and you could type in the address that you would like to use. And if it is a case that you would like to change the background color you can do that. You could select the entire page then tap on the color box in the top left hand corner. And from here you could choose a different color if you want. So you can simply tap on the color box right here and you could choose a shade that you would like to use. So for example, let's say we like to use a yellow shade. You can see the different shades right there. And if it is a case that you would like to add something more, let's say we'd like to add a dove right here or so on. You could tap on elements in the top left hand corner. Then from there you could type in, for example, dove and we are going to be selecting dove white. Then from here, you could select graphics, then scroll down until you see one that you like. So let's say, for example, we want to use this one. I'll simply tap on it. Then I'm going to minimize the size and you can see right there. After you're finished, all you'll need to do now is tap on share in the top right hand corner, then tap on download. Then you'll select download once more and that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.